Uh, we want to prove n plus 1 divides 2 and choose n. That is a binomial coefficient. Now the way we do it, we can consider the difference of two binomial coefficients. That's going to be 2n choose n. Now because it's a center, is bigger than the other one, the neighbor, which is 2n choose n plus 1. Yeah. So if you are familiar with Pascal triangle, you know the coefficient is the biggest in the middle. right? So that's a positive integer, because both are integers. Now plug in the formula, however, what do we get? The first term is 2n factorial divided by n vectorial and n vectorial, right? The second one is going to be, on the top is the same. On the bottom, it's going to be n plus 1 vectorial divided by n minus 1 vectorial, OK? So what are we going to do for the first fraction? We're going to multiply n plus 1 on both top and bottom, yeah? And for the second one, we're going to multiply n on the top and bottom. So what we have here is that, notice that uh, this is going to be the two term combined here. Yeah, these two terms is n vectorial. So in other words, the denominator is going to be the same, which is n plus 1. Yeah, times, I'm going to use a different color, n vectorial times n vectorial for both fractions, okay? So this, the same here, this here is going to be, because this thing here, this whole thing is n vectorial, and this is n plus 1 times n vectorial, okay? Same denominator here, right? And for the, for, for the numerator, however, you have 2m vectorial times n plus 1 minus n, that's 1, right? So what you see here is this is going to be 1 over n plus 1, and the other term here, 2n vectorial divided by this is nothing but 2n choose n. So we have shown that an integer on the left-hand side, the right-hand side has to be an integer, which means n plus 1 is going to divide to and choose them. All right. So it turns out that this is actually used commonly in computer science. It's called Catalan numbers. Sometimes we say C sub m. So it's z equal one over m plus one of this. Yeah, this is integer because earlier we just proven that, right? So it represents a lot of uh, counting problem. For example, let's count number of possible ways of matched bracket here. We have four pairs. It turns out that there are 14 of them. That is, the C4 equal 14, if we plug in the number here. right? And another problem is for this hexagon here, right? how many ways you can divide into maybe four different triangles. right? So there turns out to be 14 of them. In other words, the answer is also C4. Okay? So what is the C catalan number? The initial catalan numbers are the following, right? The first one is the 1, 2, and here. Okay? So hope you enjoy the video. Please subscribe to the channel.